to bring people together for the causes they claim they want. But do they do that? Because is that what they're here to do, Rome? Are they here to do that, to actually Man, organize and get people? Million, you know how bad tour for the poor will be? <laughs> Nigga, we will have buildings in damn near every goddamn state. We will have people on the ground. Boots on the ground every day, feeding people. You know how much 20 million is? Now, add that to the surplus that they are getting out there. I know they're showing doing too good, but a couple of shows are doing well online or whatever. It's just, I mean, it's, he's it's doing just, well enough. Check. He's doing well enough. He may well not, be, he may not be making it like, yeah, but he's doing right. well enough. I mean, he has deals on TV. I think, uh, what is that? He, you know, several of those 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 app TV programs. Okay, so if he if he was talking about revolution, you think he'd have that deal? If he was like, "Fuck, exactly," you know that shit. Come on, man. What are they here to bring us besides destruction? What have they brought us in the twenty years that they have that they have been here? Twenty plus years. Jenk Younger has had this massive platform and have used it for self. Uh, 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 to, to gain uh, wealth for himself and his comrades, but he don't put it out to the same communities that he say that he's care about, the same communities that he that he say that that he cry about and whatnot, that Donald Trump and the Republicans don't give a fuck about, right? But put your money where your mouth is because I get a couple of thousand dollars and I'm able to go out and feed a whole community in a whole different state. Right. Why can't they do anything, anything close to that? They wouldn't even have to do the work. They could hire somebody with the money they got. But look, with the, it takes so much because we got this, uh, CJ. Look, my accountant and rich people problems. First world, <laughs> we can't do it. It's gonna the taxes, and I gotta make sure going to a charitable. Of course, the IRS is gonna come after us. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Man, these niggas ain't serious about revolution. If they would have, they would have been dead. Nobody with that goddamn platform talking about revolution, liberation, will have the platform with they, they will have today. This nigga is swearing. I bet his suits. I bet he don't get his suits where I get my suits from. I go to man's warehouse and get them bitches off the clearance. <laughs> I bet he don't do that. Uh, I can barely afford to get my shit tailored before I walk out the goddamn building. I was about to say, whatever size they got, too, it's like, it, it better fit. Come on, man. It, it, it fits Come on, the way man. it fits. And, it, I, and I know it hurts. It hurts to know that these people have been lying to you. Damn near your whole fucking life, man. Your whole fucking life. Everything is a lie. Believe that. If you don't believe anything in this world, believe that everything is a fucking lie. And this is where you start. This is where you start, and this is where you do better. When I learned that everything is a fucking lie, I started to look at everything and everyone with a side eye, and I started to really listen to the people around me. Because even though they come with progressive language, like Jordan himself, AOC, Ilhan Omar, you know what they are here for. You know what they are here for. And we can't keep our eyes off of them. Because once you do, that, <laughs> but that's it. I think that's what that's what the critique actually. That's where the foundation of actually why they don't like Jimmy Dore is it pushed so hard against supporting any Democrat in any way and anybody supports it. I appreciate that. Nigga. Yeah, I appreciate this nigga because he still well he got like a million followers now. He got a million yeah, followers now. Yeah, and he is and he still got the balls. The pushback against the establishment, knowing that he faced so much persecution and you know, saying uh, deep platforming, yeah. deep, like, come on, man, it's so we we go through it just by how many how many subscribers we got now just on YouTube twenty three thousand. We're about to hit twenty four thousand. Yeah. If we going through it, come on, right? Yeah, these these people. <laughs> They say, oh, we agree. You know, sometimes you just got to push back. But when have you ever pushed back? Right. The only reason why we push back so hard is because y'all push back against us so much. When we're trying to teach the proletarian, hey, do you know AOC funded your money to the CIA agents? And they was running 
as Democrats. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's exactly it's, how Jake would do it. You, you, that's, you, how, that's how Jake would do it, too. He'd be like, whoa, 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 whoa. It isn't that Back simple. Up, buddy. <laughs> but it's the basic. It's the basic line. Your money went to CIA agents. Why shouldn't we call that out? You, why, what, like, they always got to flip it. Because they know what's best for them in their channel. When AOC, when when the midterms come back around, and all these motherfuckers who are into politics come back they around and start giving all these motherfuckers' views again, they're gonna be right back on these goddamn channels with, with AOC, with Ilhan Omar on TYT, or with fucking uh, uh, Nina Turner new show on TYT, Jordan, whatever the fuck. Uh, uh, Humanity Report, David Dole, fucking Kyle Kalinske, same fucking cycle, feeding you the same fucking bullshit, and y'all just sitting here eating it right off the fucking pamper.